day two of getting the front of the kitchen done and I have a lovely handsome little helper who actually matches a van. Kind of. <laughs> He's brought his tools with him because his tools are slightly a bit better than mine. Um, so we're going to get these kind of on there and the sink in and the hob in. Let's hope we get lots done today. So I'll be setting you up and you can watch what I get up to. We kind of just got a bit distracted and I forgot to go and get my set up my camera properly, but we have just done this bit. So this is actually gonna go like this. And there will be another piece like this here. Don't you worry. I'll show you how we do that. I'll set you up now so we can uh, show you. <laughs> it will be a bit better than that. <laughs> That's all setting down there. Now we're gonna carry on with the draw fronts. It's the reality of making a van boat. Let's hope that we can actually get something done today because it's now 12 o'clock. That's rude. two hours. Done today. <laughs> Very rude. Not like that attitude. <laughs> right. Finishing off a little job that um, Dwayne and I started a few weeks ago. Um, we ended up doing this job instead of doing the framing for the border of borders of the kitchen drawers. <laughs> Honestly, my brain is not in gear today. Um, so I filmed some of the stuff that you saw earlier few weeks ago and now I'm going to finish off and that is this which is my little open hatch and I've glued two bits of wood on the back so that it stays together but it's still sturdy and this bit doesn't have a bit of wood here because that bit's going to go against a bit of wood in the van I'll show you in a second so I've got that and then I've got this bracket that's going to go here on the front of it. I wanted it to go inside but it's not going to work so it's going to go here, it's going to have to go on the outside. So it's not going to be very, very secret but anyway so I've got to just grab some screws and my screwdriver and then hopefully I can fit that today. So I'll set you up. 
Where shall I set you up? Let's see, it's a hard one because it's this bit here. So you've already got a pair of shoes in there. Um, this is going to go just here. Don't worry, this bit will be finished off. This is going to sit just here and I'm going to screw this way <laughs> this to here like this and then it's just going to lift up put your shoes on put it back down so that's how it's going to go so I think I'm going to attach it to there first and then I can do the rest. Maybe you would be better here. just got to put this bit of plastic on the end but opens put my shoes in I know you see this bit but you're probably just gonna lift it to there and closes looks really good doesn't it up and down well, that was a super easy job wasn't it <laughs> let me get the plastic bit something in my eye and uh, do that I don't know why someone finished it here and that somebody might just be Dwayne <laughs> because it should have finished here but he insisted it should have gone up. it didn't need to I don't know anyway we'll see <laughs> that's all I'm gonna say to that one <laughs> then we're gonna get a bit of plastic because Oh, I think I'm going to sneeze as well. We can see, have a little bit, a little bit of a moan about Dwayne while he's working really, really hard and I'm just doing not much. <laughs> he's used to that, I think, by now. I'll speak of the devil. I might just take this bit off and redo it, but anyway, I'm not going to move this because it's gluing, it's drying, so this is all done, and that's another job ticked off the list. So, another job I've got to do is sand and oil this, uh, which I might just quite do today because I've got some time. Uh, I'll do that first before I get any of my, I've got a few bits of paint that I'm just doing, you know, 
you don't need to see me paint all the time. Sorry, I've got loads of stuff in my fingers now because I obviously use my hands to wipe things. Um, rather than a bit of blue roll. Yeah, so um, I'm just doing bits of painting here and there that you don't need to see, just priming and stuff. Um, but I don't want to prime and then sand, so I'll probably just sand this bit now paint and then that'll be it for the day and then tomorrow hopefully a little surprise finishing off of something um but yeah that's my little secret shoe hole done i'm pretty proud of that my idea my way of doing it i really wanted the um this bit to be on the inside but it just wasn't going to work so i put it on the outside which is fine, it looks really good. So yeah. I'm just gonna get on with my other little jobs so you don't need to see, and then, uh, I know it's dark. Anyway, see you tomorrow. Hey, it's a really, really, really exciting day today. So, I just got back from work and I'm just waiting for someone to arrive. That somebody is the person that has put resin on my table for Skylar. So, I'm gonna film it, obviously. Would not film this bit. Um, and uh, I'll introduce you to her and I'll show you what the table look, looks like. Now, I have not even seen the table myself yet. So it's gonna be a massive surprise. I think I'm gonna love it, but fingers crossed, because you always worry, because I know how picky I am. But that's what I'm currently waiting for now. So she says she's gonna be here around about now. So I'll let you know when she's arrived. You the start. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm so excited. She's here. My table's here. <sighs> I don't know what to do. Let me unlock Skylar. So. Oh my gosh. Up, off, um, All right. Oh, just, oh my God, it's so cool. <laughs> I go away. Yeah, don't get me in. Okay, I won't get you. <laughs> I'll put it on this side. Oh my gosh. She doesn't want to be in the video, so that's why I'm like up against the wall. <gasps> oh my god! <gasps> oh my gosh! It looks so cool. Oh, it looks so good. Oh my gosh, doesn't it look amazing? It's really hard with the sunlight, but look. Can you see? This colour matches the colour of Skylar. You can't really see in this. Honestly, you cannot see the colours in this video. If I go like this, you can see the colours, but this is turquoise and... Ah. Oh my gosh, it looks so good. And then... I've got this too! <laughs> right, I'm going to actually shut you off now so I can go and say thank you, etc. and pay for it. Anyway, that is my resin table. I'll do a nice film shot of it in a minute um, when it's not in some funny light because it's kind of not coming up properly on the camera. So yeah, you'll be able to see it soon.
I'm inside. I'm just brought it inside the house because you can see the colours better in here. And um, I'm going to talk you through what she's done. It's honestly so amazing. So basically, this is actually three layers. It goes up in a layer there and down two layers. So the resin comes all the way out to here. There's one layer, two layers, three layers. And then back down. One, two, three. It's just, it looks so good. Even, you just can't see the colour of this turquoise in this camera for some reason. It just doesn't bring it out, but I'm also going to take a picture on my phone. So hopefully you'll be able to see it. Tank is wanting to be involved in this. Aren't you, Tank? What are you doing? Tank! What are you doing? Do you like the table? Do you like our new table for Skylar? Isn't it cute? Yeah. Isn't it? We love it. Do we love it? Say yay! Yay! <laughs> yay! <laughs> Aren't you match it? Your collar matches a table, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> He's so excited, honestly. He doesn't know what this is. So yeah, I'm gonna take a picture on my phone and you'll be able to see it. This color is much more turquoise than all it shows in this camera. But I honestly, honestly love it. So I've actually asked her to do another piece for Skylar. So I'm gonna keep that a little tiny, a little secret. So I've got to source the wood for it. And I can give it to her and she's gonna get it done. So, can't wait, I literally can't wait. I need to find the wood for it. That's gonna be the thing. So, uh, yeah, anyway, I hope you like it. Let me know what you think in the comments below. I also forgot to show you. I also got a serving platter that matches my wood. So it's amazing. I just wanna give a huge shout out to Renette. If you go and have a look at her Instagram and Facebook pages, they're linked in the description below. She is Renette H Designs on both. She is unbelievable the stuff that she's got. So, and she does commission work. It's not just that she's done it for me because I know her. Um, but yeah, she does do commission work. So go and check her out and give her some love because I love my table and I think everyone's going to be like amazed at it. So yeah, um, all that information is in the comments below.